you once again for joining the Roseville Puppet Wagon. Today, we will be performing Little Red Hen. We hope you enjoy. Once upon a time, on a small farm, there lived a little red hen named Little Red Hen. She was the hardest working animal on the whole farm, and she put in a great amount of effort into everything she did. Work, work, work. That's all I ever do around here. If it weren't for me, nothing would ever get done. Little Red Hen always made sure that everything on the farm was running smoothly. Whether it was fixing the chicken coop, painting the barn, or even changing the tires on the tractor, Little Red Hen made sure that the job was done properly. One day, Little Red Hen was wandering through the farmer's field when she came upon some wheat. Oh my! The wheat really came out well this year. It's been perfect for making some bread. Oh, but making bread is such a difficult task. I'm going to need some help. Hey, Red! Did I hear that you needed some help with something? Yes, I did, Nigel. I need help making this wheat into bread. Oh, I can help you. Fiddle-dee-dee, Nigel. That's a very kind offer, but I need help from some of the larger animals. You're just a tad small to help me. Well, can I at least watch? Maybe I can help you make some bread when I get bigger someday. Well, I suppose it wouldn't hurt for you to tag along. It'll do you some good to watch a professional baker in action. Come on, then. We must get help from the other animals. First, we must find someone to help us harvest the wheat. Okay! So Little Red Hen and the young duckling went around the farm and asked the other animals if they would help harvest the wheat. Let's ask the farmer's dog. Okay. Sounds good to me. He looks like he would be a great help to us. Good morning, dog. Oh, hello there, Little Red Hen. How are you? Oh, I'm doing just fine, but I need your help. Help with what? We are trying to bake some bread. Oh. We were wondering if you could help us harvest the wheat. Me? Oh, I, I'm sorry, Red. I can't. Oh, why not? I have more important things to do. Like what? You know, things like sit here and wait for the farmer to bring me my breakfast. That's it? Well, why can't you help me? Don't worry, Ren. I'm sure there are many other animals on the farm that can help you. Bye! Gee, I guess he wasn't helpful after all. Well, we'll just have to try another animal. Look, we can ask the pig. Hello there, pig. Huh? What? Uh, Mr. Pig, I, I was wondering if you could help me harvest some wheat so we can make some bread. Uh, well, uh, I'd love to, Miss Hen, but I've got to roll around in the mud. Can't you do that later? Yeah, but it sounds a lot more fun than harvesting wheat. See ya! Unbelievable. The nerve of that selfish hog. No matter. We don't need his help anyway. Why don't we ask the cow? Well, I guess it wouldn't hurt to ask. H hello, Miss Cow. Oh, why, hello there, little red hen. Miss Cow, we were wondering if you would like to help us harvest some wheat so we could make some bread. Meh, <sighs> that sounds pretty boring. So you won't help us? Good heavens, no. Why should I waste my time on such meaningless tasks? Pretty well, thanks anyway. Mm. What do we do now? There's still one more animal we can ask, but he's pretty lazy. He might not help us. Well, we can ask him anyway. Well, there he is. Oh, hello, goat. Can I ask you for a favor? Oh, whoa. Easy there, little Miss Red. Slow down. Don't talk so fast. Um, I wasn't talking fast. Oh, now just simmer down and relax. There's no need to be in a hurry. I, I just wanted to ask you if you could help me harvest some wheat. You know, for bread. Bread? Say, that sounds good. Did you bring it with you? No, no, we need to make it first. Oh, yeah, I see. So, will you help? Um, well, nah. What? Why not? I don't need to spend my time doing hard work. All I need to do is relax, and the rest will take care of itself. You should do the same. Just forget all your troubles and relax. Yeah! Woo! Woohoo! Look! Yeah! Oh, yeah! Da 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 da! Oh, sorry. Fine. Thanks for 
for nothing, Mr. Goat. <clears throat> what do we do now? Well, I guess I'll need your help after all, Nigel. Could, could you fetch the wheat for me? Yeah, sure! Woohoo! It's hard to find good help these days. Woohoo! So Little Red Hen and Nigel harvested the wheat all by themselves. When they finished, it was time to move to the next step in making the bread. What do we do now? Well, now that we have harvested the wheat, we must make the dough. Ooh, can I help? I did a good job harvesting the wheat, right? Yes, you did, Nigel, but making the dough is a tough task. I'm not sure you'll be able to handle it. I'm going to need more help. So Little Red Hen and the small duckling went around the farm asking for help in making the dough for the bread. They asked the dog. Uh, no. They asked the pig. Nonsense. They asked the cow. Certainly not. And they asked the goat. Whoa there. Making dough is cool and all, but it's just not my style. Once again, everyone has refused to help me. I'm still here, Red. I bet I could help make the dough if you showed me how to do it. Oh, all right. I suppose I don't have a choice. Woohoo! So Little Red Hen and the Young Duckling made the dough all by themselves. It was now mid-afternoon and it was time to move on to the next step. All right. Now we need to knead the dough. But I thought we already kneaded the dough. That's why we made it. Oh, no, no, I'm talking about pushing down on the dough and mixing the ingredients together. It's a very exhausting process. I can do it! I'm sure you can, but I think it would be a lot easier if we got some help. So Little Red Hen and Nigel went around the farm and asked for help in kneading the dough. They asked the dog. No way! They asked the pig. Sounds exhausting! They asked the cow. It's way too hot for that kind of effort. And they asked the goat. Whoa, whoa. Who needs kneading when I've got all I need right here? Oh, this is hopeless. I guess we'll have to knead the dough by ourselves. I suppose we don't have any other option, do we? Well, let's try to stay positive to get w to get working on kneading the dough. OK. and the small duckling worked hard into the late afternoon. Soon it was time to move on to the next step. Well, the bread is almost done. Now all we need to do is bake the bread. Do we need more help? Yes, it would be nice to have some help. We'll go around the farm again to ask everyone. So Little Red Hen and the young duckling went around the farm and asked for help in baking the bread. They asked the dog. No. They asked the pig. Sounds boring. They asked the cow. Waste of my time. And they asked the goat. Whoa there. Those ovens are hot. I don't want to burn myself. It'll be much safer if I stay right here. I can't even get them to help with such a simple task. I know. All they have to do is help put it in the oven, right? That's right. The other animals are incredibly lazy. I guess it will just be us once again. Yay! Oh. So Little Red Hen and the Young Duckling put the bread in the oven and waited for it to bake. As the sun went down, the bread was ready to be taken out of the oven. Wonderful! Ooh. The bread is all done! What do we do now? Well, now all we need to do is eat the bread! Woohoo! Hey, I'll help you eat that bread! Me too! I would love to help you eat that bread. Hey, hey, look at that bread! You two sure know how to get, make, have a life of luxury! No! The only ones who will be eating this bread are Nigel and myself. He was the only one who helped me when I needed it most, unlike the rest of you. Here, Nigel, go in the back. You can have all the bread for yourself. Woohoo! Wow! Thanks, Miss Hen! I'm sorry that I didn't believe you because of your size. You really were such a great help to me after all. Aw, yay! So Little Red Hen and Nigel enjoyed the bread that they worked so hard on making. The other animals learned that rewards do not come without effort. 
As for little Red Hen, she never underestimated the young duckling because of his size ever again, for she knew that deep down inside, even the smallest of animals could perform the largest of tasks. The end. Woo! Thank you once again for joining the Roseville Puppet Wagon. Uh, if you would like to come visit us, please form a line at the back of the truck and we will be with you shortly. Thank you!